Having a strict NAT type may not have mattered to you until you've encountered network related issues in your Xbox Series S NAT or network address translation. Actually tells you how well your router and Xbox communicate with each other. Many network related issues with your Xbox can be attributed to a strict NAT type. In this video, we will show you how to get an open NAT on your Xbox Series S. The first thing you have to do is to enable UPnP. Most of the time, you only have to do this as Xbox uses UPnP for multiplayer gaming, chat and other network features. You will have to access your router setup page to be able to do this, and we assume you already know how to do that. To enable UPnP, log into your auto settings page, look for UPnP and click on it. Most of the time it's disabled by default, so enable it and save the change you made. Now in your console, launch settings. Highlight general and select network settings. Select testnet type and wait until the console finishes the test. If it's open, then that's all you need to do. However, if it's still strict or moderate, then move on to the next procedure. If enabling UPMP doesn't change the NAT type to open, then the next thing you need to do is to place your Xbox Series S and DMZ. The DMZ is a separate zone on your router, which you can place game consoles on your home network into to allow them to bypass firewall filtering and fully open them up to the internet for best connectivity. Here's how it's done. Press the Xbox button on your controller and select profile and system Select settings and choose general. If it's not selected yet, select Network Settings and navigate to Advanced Settings. Take note of your console's IP address. In your Router Settings page, look for DMZ and click on it. Enter your console's IP address and enable DMZ. Save the changes you made. Going back to your Xbox, trying to test NAT type again. This will change the NAT type from strict to open as your console is placed in the DMZ. If it doesn't, then reboot your Xbox and that should do it. We hope that this guide has helped you. Please support us by subscribing to our channel. And don't forget to enable the notifications so that you'll be notified when we publish new videos. Thanks for watching.